Welcome back, bud. It's been a little while. I feel like I don't, haven't had a chance to talk to you. Yeah, it's, uh, it's been trying this season here, so uh, not just here but everywhere. But uh, we're rolling pretty good right now, and uh, it feels pretty good. It feels real good. Danny, you guys have been rolling well this year in general, just maybe not clicking off the wins at the pace you'd like to. Yeah, I mean, uh, my guys have worked all their butts off, and we've had a fast car really all year. We had a one month of hiccups, and uh, can't say enough about them. Uh, I preach it left and right every time I get an opportunity, but uh, I don't thank a lot of people enough that, that don't, and that's that's my sponsors. Um, Sanders Fruit Market, Gary Kaufman, of, of course, uh, Wegers Livestock, uh, number one Cochrane Cars, Face Performance, Four Wheel RV, uh, so many people that, that do so much work uh, and put so much uh, money into this team to keep it going. And it, it's so much appreciated. Uh, Bruner Service Center, Big Cove, uh, Whitetail, uh, Job of Ink Tattoo, Bollinger Construction, just just uh, my dad's business, uh, Razor News Parts Warehouse, um, Don Ott, Maxim, so many people and all my fans. I, I really appreciate it. It's, it's been, uh, tonight was fun. Uh, kind of let Bruce there get in front of me and um, kind of just chase him down. Saw Jake uh, earlier today over at Eastern. No, I'm with you, brother. I saw Jake earlier today over at the Eastern Museum of Motor Racing. He felt pretty good coming in tonight and uh, looked like you had a car that you were pretty comfortable in. Yeah, I just uh, didn't get the fuel load burn off, and I wasn't sure how hard I needed to run, and he, he kind of snuck by me there, and uh, I just kept pounding the top down here one and two. It was really dirty on that because I felt like I was the only one running up there. Uh, maybe one other person there for a little while. It seemed like it was getting cleaned off by somebody more than me, but just it's just so dirty coming off turn two and off a of four here on the top and you know you, you can rifle it in there but you just got to make sure you get your wheel spin and, and kind of roll it afterwards uh but the car was good it was real good i knew once i got back to the lead uh well, bruce whichever buckwater that was timmy buckwater you know i knew once i got back by him i'm like well i gotta get to the bottom and unless i i absolutely have to go to the top and we were still able to go to the top uh just good all around all over really and i never had to push it real real hard other than to get back by him and uh i i felt better than he the pace he was setting so um, sometimes I'm better off just chasing somebody to know where my car stands. Danny, talk about the line through three and four. Um, eventually, you moved into the middle groove, and the car seemed to really respond well there. Yeah, I could keep uh, I could keep the car stuck right through the middle, really. Um, kind of get my left rear on the moisture on entry and uh, kind of let it roll out and just carry some speed instead of shutting it down on exit so much. You know, but then, then it got to the point where I, I didn't want to open the door up and uh, let somebody jam it in there and get in front of me. Then, then you know, the race might be over in a sense, you know, and uh, – I felt like I was leaving my door open a little bit, getting into one, and uh, I was afraid somebody was going to slide it in there, but I figured if they, if they jammed it into one on the bottom, they wouldn't be able to stick the bottom. So uh, three and four is a little different story. Wanted to protect down there a little bit. I've been beat getting uh, getting somebody shoved in underneath of me uh, a couple times this year, but uh, didn't want to happen tonight. Nobody uh, coming in under you tonight, Danny. Margin of victory at the end, 4.95 seconds. So uh, you were rolling, uh, Devin Borden, our runner-up. 17th career victory here at Baps Motor Speedway. You break the tie with Van May. I think that puts you 14th all-time, though. Yeah, I'd, uh, hard to believe that made the wins here. And uh, it's been a while since I've won here, so um, since last year. So it's been a, it feels good to, to get higher up on, uh, on the list there and Hopefully we can keep clicking them all for some big shows coming up here, that's for sure. Well, you had a great run at the Grove Friday night. You back it up with a win tonight, so congratulations. Keep up the great work, and uh, enjoy the celebration tonight. Thank you. Thanks, everybody, for coming out on Sunday. I appreciate it. Uh, come back next time.